Hello viewers, welcome to Elimu TV, a session whereby we are going to interact and also learn together. We are going to have our mathematics form 1, lesson 15, and we are going to handle the topic on natural numbers under the subtopic operations on whole numbers. Your tutor will be me, Mr. Jeremy. But before that, uh, we are going to have the following lesson objectives, whereby by the end of the lesson, you should be able to uh, perform several operations on all numbers let us begin first we're going to uh, start with the divisibility test uh, for two however we should uh, remind ourselves when is a number divisible by two we're going to say a number is divisible by two if its last digit is an even number uh, in an exam you can uh, give, be given any number so it is your uh, responsibility to look at uh, the last digit to see if it is an even number for example, we can have a number like uh, 315, then you ask yourself, is it divisible by 2? At the last digit, 0 is normally termed as an even number, and uh, through the long division, when we divide the 350 by 175, uh, sorry, 350 by 2, we are getting 175. So that is to mean our number is divisible by 2. Um, we can have a divisibility test for 2, whereby another, this is a continuation, um, where you have been told you divide 174, you divide by 2, whereby actually you are going to get um, 174, when you divide 8 by 2, you are going to get 88, uh, you, are going, you should get 88, but I can say, uh, so 174 is divided by 2 because the last digit is an even number, so it should be actually 87, uh, then we have the disability test for 3, whereby a number is divisible by 3 if the sum of its digits is divisible by 3. You get the sum of the digits. Uh, for example, you are, you are being told you work out to 57, you divide by 3. Uh, then you get the sum of the digits. So you get 1 plus 2, which is 3, plus 5, 8, plus 7, 15. Then you ask yourself, is 15 divisible by 3? Then you say yes. So 257 is divisible by 3 because the sum of the digits is 15, which is divisible by 3 to get uh, 5. So uh, the number 257 is divisible by uh, 3. We can go to subtraction, whereby you are required to work out. Uh, example 1, 73, 4, 6, 9, you subtract it to 9, 7, 1. In the solution, you just arrange it in column form, then you divide, uh, you subtract. Whereby 9 minus 1, you get 8, 16 minus 7 to get 9 and uh, 13 minus 9 to get 4, 12 minus 8 to get 4, and uh, because you borrowed 1, you're going to get 6. Then you can also be, uh, you're also required to subtract 7, 2, 5, 9, 6, minus 8, 6, 8, 7. You're getting uh, the number that we're seeing from our screen. You can go to multiplication, whereby you're required to multiply 4, 6, 9, you multiply by 63, and also 350, you multiply by 40. Now, first case, 4, 6, 9 to multiply by 63, you arrange the numbers as we have arranged in addition, but here you are going to multiply. So it's upon you to decide whether you start with 469 to multiply it by first by 6, or the 469 first, first you multiply by 3. So eventually you are going to get 29547. For the sake of 350 by 14, you are just going to do the same and eventually you are going to get 14,000. You are going to get the division, and then we say when a number is divided by another number, the result is the quotient. Sometimes a quotient and a remainder is obtained. A quotient is taken to be the whole number part. The number being divided is called the dividend and the number dividing is called the divisor. Actually, let us divide something like 6, 4, 9, 3 divided by 14. Here you are going to get uh, the dividend here is 6, 4, 9, 3 and the divisor is 14. It is convenient to use the long division method as shown. When we divide this one, we are going to get... Um, 14 is the divisor, while 6493 is the dividend, 463 is the quotient, and 11 is the remainder. Having done and said that, we are required to have the following activity. Remember, you are required to work out 536810 plus 8725 plus 473602. Uh, uh, for more reference, you can refer to the secondary mathematics students book 1, which is the 4th edition. Uh, it has been certified by the uh, Kenya Literature Bureau. And uh, to have, uh, for more of this lesson, uh, the more of our mathematics lesson, you can send us an SMS through the number that is on our screen, or you subscribe to our YouTube channel, which is Elimu TV, or our Facebook page, which is Elimu TV, or you tweet us at Elimu TV underscore. Let us subscribe to all these um, 
channels to enjoy more of our mathematics lessons. Thank you.